today in this PSLE 2019 Paper 2 question series, I'll be going through question 17. And this question is the last question of this PSLE 2019 Paper 2 question series, okay? And this question is also a really tough question. Okay, and in my channel, I want to help all of you master all those concepts out there, okay? So let's jump straight into question 17. Okay, this is question 17 and this question is testing us on the pattern concept. And this question was a really tough question. Even many students cry after the exam that they couldn't solve this question, okay? In the 2019 paper. So I'm going to teach you how to solve this question really easily. Okay, so this question has three parts, part A, B and C. I'll be going through part A right now and B and C later in this video. Let's read the question for part A first. The first four figures of a pattern are shown below, okay? Part A, fill the table for figure 5. So here's the table. Okay, first in figure 1, there's one white triangle and zero grey triangles. Figure 2, there's one white triangle and three grey triangles. In figure 3, there's six white triangles and three grey triangles, okay? And in figure 4, there's six white triangles and ten grey triangles, okay? After this, I'm going to look at this. So here is white. After that, we add gray. After that, we add white again and gray again. So in figure 5, they should add white, right? Another row of white. So in order to find the number of gray triangles, right, it's actually remaining the same. Because after I add this column known as total and pattern, right, we know that the number of grey triangles remains the same already. So let me just write that down. And what is this total and pattern? Okay, the total is basically number of white plus grey. It's 1, 4 for figure 2, and 6, and 3, 9 for figure 3, 16 for figure 4. Okay, so the pattern is basically 1 squared, figure number squared, figure number squared, 4. 3 squared is 9, 4 squared is 16. So in order to find the total for num figure number 5, it should be actually 5 squared, which will give us 25. And in order to find the white triangles, there's actually no pattern. We just need to take the total minus 10, which will give us 15. So this is the answer for part A, okay? 15 and 10. So now let's move on to part B. Okay, let me just write down this again. 5 squared and 25, okay? So, this is the question, okay? So, let's read it again. For part B, what is the number of white and grey triangles in figure 250? Okay, that's easy. We know the pattern already, right? Which is 5 square. So, for figure 250, so let me just add it here. 250, bring it down. I'm only going to focus on these two rows. This is not applicable, okay? These two rows. It should be 250 squared, right? Right? So it will give us 250 times 250, which will be 6,200. 6, 62,500. Sorry, I said it wrongly. So the answer is 62,500. So let me write it down. 62,500, okay? So this is how you do it. Okay, is the pattern that we found in part A. We use that in order to find the total number. See, the total, this is the pattern. Okay, so I hope you understand part B. Let's move on to part C now. Okay, this part was a bit tricky for everybody. Part A and B was quite simple for everybody to find the pattern, but part C was the killer question, okay? And I'm going to help you solve this question. So first, they add another row called difference. Okay, so 1 minus 0 is 1, one 3 minus 1 is 2, 6 minus 3 is 3, and 10 minus 6 is 4. Okay, do you realize something? In every odd figure, the difference, in every figure, right, the difference is actually the figure number. 1, 2, 3, 4, see? So the difference for this is 15 minus 10, right? It's still 5. So it's the same as the figure number. Okay? So I hope you understand that. So 
Now that you have figured out this, there's actually another thing that you realized. For odd figures, there's actually more white than grey triangles. And for even figures, there's actually less white and more grey triangles. See? Odd, more white and less grey. Even, more grey and less white. Okay, and they are asking in figure 250, what percentage of the triangles are grey? Okay, so in figure 250, what is figure 250? Is it even or odd? It's even, right? So that's actually more grey than white. Okay, so I'm going to write this note that all of the patterns that we have found so far, total is equal to figure number squared, difference is equal to figure number, odd figure number is equal to more white than grey, even figure number is equal to more grey than white. Okay, so for part C, we need to find grey over 6,200 sorry 62,500 times 100 percent right so this is how you find the percentage of gray triangles but we need to find the gray first okay and we know that 250 is even so gray is more than white and we know the difference in the figure 250 which is 250 so the gray is 250 more than the white let me draw a quick model so this is the model gray is 250 more than the white so that is why the total is 62,500, right? So, in order to find the number of grey triangles, we just need to take 62,500 plus 250 divided by 2, which will give us 31,375, or we could take 62,500 minus 250. Okay, so plus 250 is giving, is adding clay or play-doh, okay? So you're giving this and when you divide by 2, you'll get the grey only. Okay? Get it? Okay, so I think you got the first method. And then the second method is a bit weird, right? You minus 250. You minus this. So you, you're using the scissors to cut it. Okay? After that, when you take this minus 250 and you divide by 2 and you divide by 2, you'll get this only. After that, you have to add 250 again so this is 1u right then you must 1u plus 250 again okay so it's, there's more work to do so basically the second method is basically um, dividing by 2 plus 250 again which will still give us 31,375 gray so basically I'm just going to take this and change this gray into 31,375 which will give us 50.2 percent as the answer okay so 50.2 percent is the answer for part c okay so i hope you understood my explanation for this question and thank you and bye bye i'll see you in my next video bye